Now severe weather, summer threats. All week long, we're uncovering new information on what's being done to help keep you safe from potential summer weather threats. Southern New England, of course, no stranger to hurricanes, tropical storms, and in downtown Providence, the first line of defense is the Fox Point hurricane barrier. That's right, and we're going to show you a live look at the half-century-old landmark, and we've learned it's undergoing constant improvements to make sure that it's ready to protect the city the next time a hurricane hits. Meteorologist T.J. Del Santo has a story from the Providence Mobile Newsroom. The Fox Point hurricane barrier is 50 years old. Because of its design, it's still very functional, but it's always in need of repair. The Fox Point hurricane barrier was built to protect billions of dollars of interest in the city of Providence. It was a result of the, the massive flooding in 38 and 54. Construction was completed in 1966. It has two functions. The gates block a storm surge from flooding Providence, and these five pumps bring water out of the Providence River into Narragansett Bay while the gates are closed. It has protected the city from storms like Gloria, Bob, and Sandy. The city operated the barrier since its construction was finished, but the cost of upkeep got expensive. In 2005, we were able to transfer the authority for the maintenance and support of the hurricane barrier to the Corps of Engineers. We do 24-hour uh, monitoring of water levels, always doing predictive analysis on when we might have to close the gates. Now 50 years old, the barrier is being updated with modern technology. This is sophisticated, state-of-the-art. They've taken analog clocks and put digital ma machinery in there. Senator Jack Reed helped secure about $1 million for the barrier this year. And in the last uh, decade, they've put in over $18 million. There are many parts that need attention. One of the pumps and one of the gates are under repair, but the barrier is still ready to battle Mother Nature if needed. A lot of it is, is the same design that was in 1966, and just the forethought of the, of the the engineers that built it then, they built a really durable design. Another major improvement in the last decade is that the controls to the barrier can be monitored remotely so engineers can know if everything is working okay with the barrier, even from home. With the Providence Mobile Newsroom, I'm TJ Del Santo, Eyewitness News. Eyewitness News and the Pinpoint Weather Team will be bringing you in-depth coverage of severe weather summer threats all week long. Coming up later tonight on Eyewitness News at 530, Tony will have a look ahead at this year's hurricane forecast.